In this video, I will show you how to fix the Roblox error code 279. So if you're trying to play Roblox and you've actually got a error code coming up that looks like this, where it says fail to connect to the game, error code 279, there is a fix for this. It's very simple to do, but there are a few steps you need to follow. So make sure you do pay close attention and don't skip ahead through the video. So the first thing you're going to want to do is actually come to the search bar in the bottom left hand corner and you want to click this and type CMD. What you then want to do is right click onto the command prompt app that should be coming up and then you want to click on to run as administrator. So this is going to go ahead and open up a window that looks like this and from here this is what you're going to type. So the first thing you want to type is IP config then you want to do a space and then a forward slash and then you want to put flush DNS and hit enter. So you should get a message saying successfully flush the DNS resolver cache. Don't worry about all this, just follow along. Uh, the next thing you're going to want to type in here is net sh and then you want to put a space and then win so win sock and then hit enter. And the next thing we're going to do is just type one final thing. So we're going to put net sh space winsock again. And then what we're going to do is put a space and put reset and hit enter. So you're going to get another message saying successfully, successfully reset the winsock catalog. Again, don't worry about this too much. Um, and then after that, you can just go ahead and type exit and hit enter. So that's that bit done and there's another step you need to do before you can actually start playing. So what you now need to do is come back down to the search bar down in the bottom left hand corner and you want to type into this control panel. And then go ahead and open up the control panel app. So from here you want to look for network and sharing center. So you want this option here. Go ahead and give that a click. And then from here, what you're going to want to do is click onto your connected internet connection. So you can see up here where it says access type internet connections and you'll see it's going to come up with a line. So you just want to go ahead and give that a click. That's going to load up a page that's going to look like this. So from here, you want to come down to the properties button down here and this is going to bring up another window which is going to look like this, the Wi-Fi properties window. So from here, you want to look for Internet Protocol version 4. So this option here and just go ahead and give that a click. And then what you want to do is click onto the properties box down here. From this window, you're now going to come down to the bottom and where it says use the following DNS server addresses, you just want to click onto that box to bring this up. And then in the preferred DNS server box, you want to type the following. So you want to type one, 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 one. And into alternative DNS server, you want to put the following, which is one, zero, zero, and one. Once that's done, just go ahead and click OK. And once that's done, you can just go ahead and close everything down. So just close these boxes, come out of this window. And then all you want to do is come down to start and restart your computer. After restarting your computer, this should solve the problem for the 279 error code on Roblox. So I hope this video helped you out today and make sure you hit that subscribe button to stay up to date with the latest tech tutorials for everything tech and digital related. Also, I just want to take a minute to thank you for watching and with that being said, I will see you guys in the next video.